Answer to question 2.1.2. From question 2.1.1, we are having the sequence 3, 2, K, and so on. That is the sequence given, which is a geometry. We need to calculate our K. 3 is T1, 2 is a T2, and K is T3. So therefore, we can see K is the same thing as T3, which is time 3. Now, from the above formula, we have T2, which is a common ratio formula. T2 divided by T1 is the same thing as T3 divided by T2. Now, we have T2, which is equal to 2, divided by T1, which is 3, equal to T3, which is our unknown, which is K, divided by T2 which is the same thing as 2. Now, we can cross multiplication now. 3 multiplied by k is 3k, and 2 multiplied by 2 is 4. We divide both sides by 3 to get our k. So it's going to give us k equal to 4 divided by 3. So which means our k is equal to 4 over 3. That is the answer for question 2.1.2 but we can still have alternative solution let us have alternative alternatively we have a which is the same thing as t1 we have our t2 which is the same thing as a multiplied by common ratio which is ar and uh, our t3 we give us a multiplied by r raised to power 2, which means common ratio raised to power 2. That is a t3, our time 3. Therefore, t3 is going to give us our a is 3 multiplied by common ratio as calculated. We have 2 over 3 square. Now, this one is the same thing as 3. Multiply by 2 over 3. Multiply by 2 over 3. This 3, we go for this 3. Now, therefore, we are going to have 2 multiplied by 2, which is 4 over 3, which is our T3. Remember that K is equal to T3. Therefore, K is equal to 4 over 3. The first method and the second method, we have the same answer. So, therefore, our K is equal to 4 over 3. That is the answer for question 2.1.2.